show you the Navy Sailor 4000 like this uh, quick reference guide. So here you can see here is our keyboard and also here is our Agdis. For your information, we have two Agdis on board because uh, our primary means of navigation is Agdis. There are uh, no paper chart. Uh, we have paper chart but already in sleeping condition. We are no more using this paper chart. I only using Agdis because uh, we have uh, both individual uh, Agdis also have backup. So let's start with this keyboard. Here you can see we have this uh, EBL option, electronic bearing line. Here I have one or two and uh, with this one we can uh, use uh, this EBL over there. We can EBL switch on this EBL on and off like here. You see already EBL coming. If I rotating this button and this one also moving, see this one also moving. From this one you can take the bearing of uh, any target and uh, after that you can uh, monitor this one so for collision avoidance or any other navigation purposes okay let's uh, switch off this avl okay and also you can notice that uh, it light is uh, become changing also after switching or switch it on and also switch it off here we have this uh, track control this uh, track quick track and also stop also we have this uh, BRM on off button also here and also here is the regulator track. Next we have this uh, opening the transist integrator toolbar. Okay, this one is this one is our navy planner. If we uh, press this button, with this button we can uh, check. You see, I just press this button and this one coming and also and uh, to minimize this one you have to click on this like this. And here we have can see so many functions are there to stop this uh, system and in. stop this system here is the restart button if i put, uh, put in the click on the axis then it will be minimized and uh, here also have alarm functions over here here is our navy planner and uh, this one is playback feature and this one is data tool in utility and this one is service tools this one is uh, Read manual actually, Adobe uh, Reader by the Adobe Reader, you can read the manual, also can download. And here is the setup function, here is the USB function. Uh, whenever we put any USB here, because we uh, weekly we have to update our ENC, our electronic navigation chart, and also so many license or something, uh, some other job, we have to put uh, this uh, USB. So to eject or put this USB function, uh, here is our USB function. And uh, here is our help button. This one is uh, bridge alarm management viewer. With this one, you also uh, other name is uh, Bonwas. This navigation watch alarm system is uh, already uh, integrated with this uh, Agdis. And also here we have Navy Server 4000 Agdis some button and also the Planner 4000. Let's again go back to our keyboard because uh, keyboard is also more important for our Agdis panel. So here you can see here is our as like a normal keyboard here. All this vertical and memory keyboard is there. We have to the use of this one is in actually during process planning and also some other uh, navigation warning behind here. We put in the by the manual correction that time we use this keyboard and this is uh, very important and also here is some shortcut key also you, you might know and uh, like this if you, if you see alter and tap all this navigation uh, some panel is uh, some changing if you want to minimize this one again uh, you press this uh, alter tab button then it will go back to normal position sometime uh, when we uh, switch on this uh, navy planner that time uh, suppose uh, i am monitoring or uh, updating my enc or some other job maybe i am making passes plan in the navy planner that time also i have to see my actis that time I uh, use this button actually, alter tab. After that, uh, here you have for the radar feature over there uh, to transmit and standby button for this actually radar. Uh, if radar, uh, radar is already uh, integrated with this system, here we have C, C gain, C and rain, uh, rain button is there. So with this one, we can control our radar also. Which one is integrated with this system? And also you can see at this button, radar button, pointing and auxiliary uh, button and uh, show radar, all layers, uh, show chart, uh, 
turn by display target overlay also here you can see here is the dimmer dimmer is actually for the keyboard actually you see uh, as i can increase this brightness uh, in going up and also decrease this dimmer is dimming also we have this uh, day or night option uh, with this one we uh, use this for the active display if i push this button now in uh, in the night mode so you see it's changing also yeah during daytime we use this one and uh, during night time uh, we use this one as you can see when uh, we are sailing in night time the breeze is uh, totally dark and uh, that time it should be also dark uh, because otherwise uh, it will affect uh, in our navigation duty that's why this feature is there also we have this uh, zoom in and zoom out button with this one uh, used to uh, zoom in or zoom out our chart and uh, chart layer you see as you can see zoom in zoom out Done. also so many alarm used to come uh, because of this uh, for you can see or some navigation hazard or some safety contour or depth contour uh, so many alarm used to come so that time we just acknowledge or switch off this alarm we can uh, use this button but uh, whenever you uh, use this button but be careful uh, you already acknowledge the alarm and also check uh, for what reason this alarm coming and also for that one you can check here so showing the indication that uh, which alarm is coming you see here act is 100 percent EIS capacity and here is uh, existing cautions some cautions is there anchor prohibited some area fairway restricted area encourage area harbor limit so many uh, caution is coming so we, uh, take, we have to take care about this thing also some event is there and also mob button is there here is also another mob feature is there already if uh, in any case suppose man overboard that time we quickly click this button uh, to automatically uh, fix uh, put the position of the man overboard after that uh, we can uh, so it will be very easy for us uh, to rescue that man also you can see here is our mouse and this is our mouse uh, you see you can uh, watch in the uh, screen and uh, this is our uh, left button for the right handed person and this is our also left button for the left handed person and this is our right button and uh, with this one we can scroll zoom in and zoom out or also some other feature also have and uh, this one is our from the pony suppose uh, i push on the left button you see this button is coming and also right button to go this one actually this one i uh, use as uh, like as uh, left button and this one uh, this uh, right button uh, this small one here uh, for the cancel uh, whenever you do any route planning or any passage planning over here over on the like this at uh, that time it is very useful and also you have to know so many shortcut and also so many uh, tricks actually uh, to use this uh, mouse and this left or right button it will be very useful for you this target button uh, this target button actually uh, for the turning on or off display of the ARPA and the uh, AIS target uh, already connected with all of this now I am going to describe you uh, the chart panel bar here you can see this is the alarm status uh, all this alarm status and acknowledgement warning status and acknowledgement uh, caution status all are here if uh, we are uh, checking some other route, uh, suppose if I go like this and go like this and uh, uh, and put, uh, push this button, you see, we come to this again, uh, our own position. Like return to the display of the area where the ship is located. And uh, this one, this option is for set own ship symbol at any location of the chart panel, you see. And uh, next is our north up, head up and course up mode. Uh, we normally use our north up mode also we can use the head up mode you see our uh, direction is changing and uh, also this one force up mode as per now force over ground is 358 so normally we use the north up mode also we have the option this relative motion and also true motion selected uh, relative motion mode or true motion mode and uh, this one for the zoom in and zoom out again zoom in and this one for the zoom out option and this one describe our scale display the chart on the original scale actually and uh, this one for the information suppose uh, to know anything on like this uh, display so you just click this option and uh, good for any this one you see for this one you can check this information object information general information you see here uh, you can see this depth control is uh, 
30 meter as per uh, 20 September 2018. Also, some other information you can get. You see magnetic variation, parts are fixed site for the magnetic variation along a light or, or over an area 2018. Uh, zero minute, so and so. Anchorage area, anchorage area, harbor area, depth area, so and so, so and so. Also, one of the most important feature over here. Here you can uh, find our this general information that is presentation library edition 4.0.0. One of the very important feature and also every OW uh, duty officer on board also especially second officer must and must know about this feature because whenever any vetting inspection or any sign inspection or any type of inspection or PC inspection inspector coming that time uh, they used to ask uh, what is your edition of this at this uh, so you will uh, just uh, Again, uh, I show you this one. You close, you click on this option, this info option, and uh, click any of uh, any of the exit display, any anything uh, on the exit. You just click on that, and then you can get this information. You see, this is the pipeline and information coming. You see this pipeline, and uh, in any symbol, you find this channel information. From here, you can show them that uh, this our presentation library edition is 4.0.0 and uh, producing agency code is Singapore Hypography Department Maritime and Port Authority MPA and uh, producing country code also Singapore and this uh, compilation scale and edition number and issue date and horizon datum WGS 84 world uh, geodetic system 84 this is very important information over there it's also a very vertical datum a sounding datum depth units and the update records get uh, object information and also general information you can click also can here quick pay for quickly going and on top you see on top again you can click on this for the general information you can quickly go for the general information then you can show them that uh, for yourself and also for the inspector or for anybody who ask you then you can give answer okay next is our use a quick distance tool and select the mode of distance measurement uh, whenever we want to measure any distance on the, because before on paper chart we used to use this uh, pass or something like that parallel ruler and this thing we use uh, for the measuring, dist uh, measuring distance uh, uh, measuring any distance uh, that time we can use but on the uh, here on the edges because uh, here every time zoom if you zoom in and zoom out is scale changing scale changing so we cannot measuring the distance so always you you can use this quick distance tool this ram line and this one is uh, your circle so normally we use the ram line let's see suppose from our anchor position uh, from our anchor position to that shape Suppose this ship is around uh, total distance 0.24, I mean uh, 40, 437 meter, uh, 0.24 nautical mile, range is 0.24. So, opposite bearing, very important tool uh, whenever uh, you go to any port or something as enduring passage planning or enduring, uh, enduring passage also, you can uh, get um, this. Suppose you have one boy. So you want to know this bearing and also opposite bearing from your own position also latitude longitude of that position and uh, particularly then uh, you can click on that over here see I click my position also this is the boy I can get this bearing is 036 opposite bearing is 216 range is 1.18 nautical mile that's all also you can see here the boy distance is uh, also changing Also from the boy, how much you can check our position? Bearing is 236.2 and the opposite bearing 056.2. So many information and also quick distance tool. This one is quick distance tool. Next is our turn on the display of the chart over the radar picture, and also next is our open transverse integrator toolbar. And uh, next is uh, our select the screen color uh, palette to sweet outside illumination actually same like uh, here we can see uh, show you in the keyboard actually already this uh, day night and uh, this button here also 
on uh, this display also you can use this one you see here this uh, daylight mode night mode and so many more are here and this is our uh, settings this is the virtual keyboard create and user configurations see? and this is our man overboard enable man overboard mode already i told you this one uh, we use if in case any man overboard that time we quickly uh, click on this button so that uh, automatically position ported on the edges